approaching 90 degrees here in Portland. We're, we're at 87. It's going to climb because our high temperature usually hits around 5 or 6, Joseph. Yeah, I think we're going to get maybe about 88 degrees today. We'll see if we can get to 90. There's some high thin clouds out there, but boy, it is hot. And it would be the first 90 degree day so far this year. I think it's probably going to arrive tomorrow, but it is very warm. People are going to the coast to try to cool down. Temperatures were in the 70s there today. You can see the wonderful views across Portland today. As I mentioned, temperatures in the upper 80s. It kind of felt like July. I rushed down to the waterfront. My blues festival has to be today because it feels like July, but it really isn't. It's uh, we're still in May, and so this is pretty hot outside for us. We are a good 10, 15 degrees above average, but beautiful weather. Uh, it's really nice to be out in about today. You can see the Dalles to seaside, Stoller, some high clouds, but temperatures climbing and climbing. 85 come out Forest Grove right now. These are current temperatures. 88 for Lake Oswego. Hope you've had a wonderful weekend and for your Memorial Day today as well. All right, we have some 80s to the north up in Battleground and off towards the east for Troutdale. And I do want to step out of the way to see Washougal there at 83 degrees. So plenty of locations seeing the warmest day that they've seen so far, felt so far this year. Tomorrow, though, look at that. I have 93 degrees. The record's 94. When I was in on Saturday, I had 91, and it keeps on climbing. So I think we're going to be very close to that record for tomorrow. 90 on Wednesday. Uh, the record's 98, climbing to about 100. I don't think we're going to get close to that one. And then by Thursday, we do cool down relatively to the lower 80s, which is still a good 7 degrees above our normal for this time of the year. So the record on Thursday is 91. If uh, that was Tuesday's record, we would beat that, no doubt. All right, so... I think it's going to be our first 90 degree day of the year. If we don't see that today, if we don't arrive to 90 today, if we get in the upper 80s, tomorrow will definitely be the day. On average, it's mid-June, so we'll be arriving a little bit early. But notice that last year we hit 91 on May 28th, just a few days after Memorial Day last year. All right, heat advisory is going to be in place, though, from the Dallas extending over towards Pendleton. That goes into effect tomorrow. Still have some time. Although today is warm, tomorrow kicks up a notch, and we'll keep that heat advisory until Thursday. Thursday, I'm also a bit concerned because I think it's going to get a bit breezy out there as well, so we'll have to keep an eye on that. Heat advisory down towards Medford where they may hit triple-digit heat. Right in time for our meteorological summer. That's just June, July, and August. We compile those three months together there. We'll call it meteorological summer. That starts tomorrow. Wraps up August 31st. You can see the average temperature there. That's the high and the low put together, and then... You see the average rain. We really fall off come July and August. These are actually the rain totals that we've pretty, been pretty close to April and May. So that's how dry it's been this spring. But every once in a while, June brings in some rain, and you get the June gloom, and maybe that's something that we'll see this year. But for now, it doesn't look like it. 87 degrees will be cooling down, possibly to about the 70s by 9 p.m. Very warm tonight. We had a beautiful shot of the Willamette River there. Temperature is about 60 degrees in the Willamette River right now. Most of the rivers in the 50s, so it's still fairly cold. Please be careful out there. A ridge of high pressure still develops over the top of us for the next few days. That's why our temperatures are soaring. Eventually, it does break on down, and we'll see some cool air arrive by the weekend. Not much cooler, though. Look at this. We cool down to about 79 degrees on Friday, Saturday at 73. I'm hopeful that we get a little bit of rain on Sunday with some temperatures in the 60s, but for now... I think we're going to see our first 90 degree day coming up here shortly. Yeah, June giving us our first uh, taste of summer as we head into a new month. Yeah. yeah. Thanks, Joseph. Coming up.